Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 11.01 a.m., and it's Saturday, August 12th, 2023. This is my 2,000th energy drink review video. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm finally, I'm finally filming this one. Um, I was gonna try to film it a few weeks ago, but I had to trade Energy Drink Josh. I was gonna trade him some drinks, but I had to wait for him to get back in stock for me to trade him. So yeah, I finally sent him the package, and then he sent me the package. So yeah, I'm finally gonna be reviewing this drink. On um, this is a new flavor of the ghost energy drinks. This was exclusive to GNC, but my GNC never got this. And um, I guess it's also exclusive to like Kroger owned grocery stores, but there's no Kroger owned grocery stores in Oklahoma too. So um, I couldn't get this one. So yeah, I got it from Energy Drink Josh. So thanks for trading with me. So yeah. But yeah, I'll put his Instagram link and stuff in the description of the video so you can check him out, I guess. Um, but yeah, anyway. This is another flavor based off of like a bubble gum. It's based off of Bubblicious bubble gum. The Bubblicious ghost that I reviewed before was the um, strawberry splash one. It was like a strawberry bubble gum flavored ghost energy drink. But this one's based off of the Bubblicious cotton candy flavor. So this is gonna be like a cotton candy flavored of like bubble gum energy drink. So this one might be pretty good. We shall see. It's a little bit more unique, I guess. Um, but um, anyway, it has a really cool can design, like the colors of it and stuff and stuff. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the new Cotton Candy Bubblicious Ghost Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, 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 oh yeah. It's actually not technically new anymore. Um, because it was out like a couple months ago. And it's out for a limited time. And it's going to be out for like, um, during the summer. But now I think it's like already being like, um, they're already getting rid of it until like next year, I think. But they'll probably bring it back next year because I brought back the, um, normal Bubblicious Ghost this year, and they brought it back last year too, um, so they keep bringing it back, so they'll probably bring back this one too, but we shall see, but um, anyway, um, so yeah, really cool looking can, I like the colors and stuff with the blue and the pink, it stands out, you know, just saying, and it has a silver top with a silver tab, Bombs the Best Buy Dayton production code, Best Buy July 2024. So it's still fresh for a while. It's in a labeled can. It has a little bit of texture on it. Like where the ghost logo and stuff is. It's like raised. Also where it has the Bubblicious name. It's like textured a little bit. But I like the design. It has like a... Looks like a liquidy design. I guess it's supposed to be like um Like a like a popped bubble, you know? Because it looks like a popped bubble gum. It's like a splashed out, you know? Looks pretty cool. But yeah, around the top says energy, zero sugar, natural caffeine, carnipure carnitine, ghost, bubblicious cotton candy, natural and artificial flavor, zero sugar per can, energy drink, 16 fluid ounces, 473 milliliters. And yeah, why I just want to do this one as my 2000th energy drink review was because um, the first Bubblicious Ghost was like one of my favorite energy drinks the last few years. So I was thinking this one might be pretty good too. Um, so yeah, and this one was like um, exclusive flavor. So this one was a little bit hard for me to get. So this one's why I want to do this one as like my 2000th review because it's a little bit special, I guess. Um, but yeah. Legendary Energy, Epic Focus, Zero Sugars, No Artificial Colors, and it shows like a brain, a lightning bolt, a sugar thing, and like a droplet. Zero sugar per can, zero fat per can, zero artificial colors, transparent label. You used to think transparent label meant you can like take off the label and like see through it with like a flashlight or something. I guess it's just like um, they list all the ingredients, not like hide anything. Ghost, 1000 milligrams, Carn Pure Carnitine, 200 milligrams, Natural Caffeine, 150 milligrams, Alpha GPC, 50%, 100 milligrams, Neuro Factor, 100% four late daily vitamins. I almost messed up talking, but um, yeah. Anyway, it has like, um, in the background pattern, it shows like a graffiti type of design. It says, hello, my name is Ghost, legendary energy epic focus. It has like the Illuminati all seeing eye symbol. Pretty cool design. Yeah, it shows like um, some cotton candy on a stick. It's like pink cotton candy. But, um, the, I thought the normal cotton candy bubble gum was blue, though, like this background. But the cotton candy on the stick is pink, though. So that's interesting. Um, but yeah. 
and it has SKU. Warning, caution, this product is only intended for healthy adults 18 years of age or older. I'm not consuming if you're sensitive to caffeine or in combination with caffeine or stimulants from other sources. Too much caffeine may cause nervousness, irritability, sleeplessness, and occasional rapid heart rate. Not for use by women who are pregnant or nursing or trying to become pregnant. Consult a licensed qualified healthcare professional before consuming this product. Not use if you're taking any prescription drug and or have any medical condition. Nutrition pack, serving size 1 can, 16 fluid ounces, amount per serving calories 15. Total fat 0 grams or percent, cholesterol 0 milligrams or percent, sodium 35 milligrams 2 percent. Total carbohydrates 2 grams 1 percent, total sugar 0 grams, clothes 0 grams, added sugar 0 percent, protein 0 grams 0 percent. Vitamin C 90 milligrams 100 percent, vitamin B6 1.7 milligrams 100 percent. Niacin 16 milligrams 100 percent, vitamin B12 2.4 micrograms 100 percent. The hen has the other ingredients, carbonated water, natural artificial flavor, l carnitine L-tartrate, taurine, citric acid, malic acid, sucralose, caffeine, sodium, benzoate preservative, potassium sorbate preservative, alpha, glycerol, poly, phosphoryl, choline, which is the alpha GTC, sorbic acid, coffee, arabica, coffee, fruit extract, tartar acid, niacinamide, astragalus membranaceous root extract, panax ginseng root extract, and the pyridoxine, well, pyridoxal 5-phosphate, and methacobalamin, manufactured for ghost beverages, LLC, 5651 South Edmond Street, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89118 USA. The number is 1844-GHOST88, which is 446-7888. Ghost Energy Mount Burkan, it's their Ghost Energy Blend. It's Carnapier L-Carnitine L-Tartrate, 1000 mg, Taurine, 1000 mg. Natural Caffeine from the Coffee Beans, 200 mg. Alpha GPC, 50%, 150 mg. Neurofactor Coffee, which is the Arabica Coffee Fruit Extract, 100 mg. The Astrogen Root Extract, so is 25 mg. Vegan Friendly, Gluten Free, Zero Sugars, Carnipure, Astrogen, Neurofactor. Carnipure is a Lanza trademark, registered in USA, Astrogen, New Live Science USA. Neurofactor is a trademark of VDF Futureceuticals Incorporated. Bolish is a trademark of Mondelez International Group, used under license. Mondelez International Group also makes the Oreos, and they make um, Chips Ahoy and the um, Sour Patch Kids, and also... Um, like some other like stuff that Ghost is like partnered with. Only intended for persons 18 years or older. Ghost Energy is low in calories at Ghost Energy at Ghost Lifestyle. Also Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok logos. www.ghostlifestyle.com. Legends Recycle has a recycling logo. See how that's pretty much the entire can. So let you see it right quick. Not for sure the Price Energy Drink got this. Well, and the Price Energy Drink Josh got this for. Um, Cause I don't know if you got it at Jeans or at C or at the um, Kroger grocery stores. Yeah, sorry for myself talking, but um, yeah, I don't know if you got it at Jeans or at the um, Kroger grocery stores. But I think you probably got it at Jeans, so it's probably around like three something a can. So I guess okay priced. Um, but yeah, I already showed you the top and the bottom. I'm trying to make this while it's still cold. I have to go get my brother soon. He gets off at 11.30. That's 11.09 right now. So I'm trying to make this review sort of quickly. I'm trying to make this, you know, when it's still not too hot out outside. It's supposed to be like 100 degrees later. This is going to be like really hot. But um, tomorrow's going to be the last hot day for a little bit. And it's going to be back in the high 80s, so that'll be good. Okay, the SKU, the warning. Yeah, but this is a milestone review. 2,000 energy drink reviews filmed. Well, actually filmed like almost 2,030. Because I already have like almost 30 reviews filmed, which I'll be uploading after this one. Because I was waiting to get this one in the mail. But I was still filming like other reviews though. So I didn't want to get too behind. Because I have them like all on my bedroom floor. Yeah, um, this is making it a little bit hard to walk around, you know. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. Anyway, now I'm going to show off the can up closer real quick, so hold on a minute.
the new Cotton Candy Bubblicious Ghost Energy Drink. Really cool looking can. I like the blue and the dark blue and the pink. Pretty cool color combinations. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit of a textured can. Just like the other ghost cans. I like this like swirly design on the side of it. It's a little bit more different compared to like the other ghosts. Still has like the graffiti background pattern. There's the, like the Illuminati all seeing eye symbol. The ghost logo is textured. It's raised a little bit. Bubblicious cotton candy. And where it shows the cotton candy is textured too a little bit. Where it says the name. Zero Sugar, Legendary Energy, Epic Focus, Transparent Label, I used to think you could see through it, but I guess it just lists all the ingredients. Shows like a diamond, a brain, and a lightning bolt. Hello, my name is Ghost, Legendary Energy, all that stuff. Yeah, Carnapure, Carnitine, Natural Caffeine, Energy, Zero Sugar. Besides so SKU and the warning. I have to try to fix this video's white balance and stuff. Color temperature. Because I don't know why, but blue drinks, certain blue drinks, like makes the Lighting go all yellow on my videos, on my camera, and my nutrition facts. The ingredients, the distributor information, energy blend info, vegan friendly and gluten free. I don't want to focus on that though. My cat's under me. Legends Recycle has a recycling logo, all the other logos. Bombs uh, Best Buy July 2024, so it's still fresh for a while. Silver Top, Silver Tab. Sick. Okay, yeah, that's pretty much basically the entire can. Anyway, now I'm going to finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. But I'm going to show you my kitten right quick. It's by my feet. I know my floor is messy, but there is carrot. Full focus. It's not one focus. My little orange cat. He's cute. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna finish my review. So hold on, that. Okay, show off the can up close, and I'm gonna shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on, that. Um, but yeah, they'll probably bring back this flavor next year. So if you haven't got the chance to try this one yet, might be able to try it next year. Um, I don't know if your GNC might still have this, or like, um, your Kroger-owned grocery stores might still have this. But try to get it while you can, I guess. I opened it, inside the liquid is like, um, a little bit like an off-white, clearish color. Has like a little bit of like a yellowish tint. Reminds me a little bit of like pineapple juice or something. You know what it looks like. A little bit carbonated and a little bit bubbly. Um, but yeah, anyway, the scent. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 Definitely smells like something I've had before. Has a little bit of like a, um... Like sort of like a chemically scent. Um, definitely an artificial sort of scent. It reminds me a little bit of the um, Blue Raspberry Performix energy drinks that I reviewed before. That was in like a sort of like a Monster Hydro bottle, but it was like a had like floating beads in it. That one was like a had a weird chemically blue raspberry taste. But um, this smells a little bit similar to that. Also a little bit similar to like the um, Frozen Bombsicle C4 energy drink. And um, some other like Bomb Pop or Rocket Pop energy drinks that I've had before. It smells actually similar to like the Faze Pop Ghost um, that Ghost also made. It has like a citrusy sort of scent, but also a little bit berry. Even though it's supposed to be like, um, I guess cotton candy bubble gum, but um, 
might have a little bit of bubblegum scent, but um, definitely not as um, good as like the um, Strawberry Splash one. That was definitely more like a bubblegum sort of scent. Um, it doesn't really smell like cotton candy to me. Maybe a teeny bit. Like a teeny bit similar to like the Bang cotton candy. But um, this is definitely more of like a chemically sort of scent. So it's um, not as good as I was expecting it to be. Uh, but anyway, and I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, 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 well. Well, 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 well. And yep, the taste definitely has a more noticeable bubblegum flavor than the scent did. Um, yeah, I can definitely notice the bubblegum taste and the flavor. But yeah, I kind of notice that in the scent. Well, 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 well. Yeah, it doesn't really taste like cotton candy bubble gum to me. Like I had the bubble gum, like cotton candy um, bubble gum before. I never had like the bubblelicious cotton candy gum before. So I can't really um, describe it accurately or whatever. If it was like, um, if it like tastes accurately, you know. But um, definitely tastes different than the um, cotton candy bubble gum bubble gum. I had that one before, but not the bubblelicious kind. I might have a little bit of a similar like bubblegum taste, but um, yeah, the cotton candy part doesn't really taste like too much like cotton candy. This is actually to me more like a berry flavor. So to me, this is actually more like a berry bubblegum. But yeah, it's still pretty good. Definitely like a blueberry raspberry bubblegum. And that's what it like reminds me the most of, you know, just saying. I think there was like a blue raspberry bubblegum I had before. This reminds me a little bit of that. Even though um, this isn't supposed to taste like blue raspberry. Definitely has a similar like a taste of blue raspberry though. And the colors even match blue raspberry. With like the dark blue and the pink and stuff. So yeah, definitely reminds me of that instead of like cotton candy. But um, yeah, it still definitely has a bubblegum taste though. Um, but, um, I think I like the Strawberry Splash one of the Bubblicious Ghosts better than this one. But, um, this one's still actually pretty good. It has a little bit of a unique flavor. But, um, yeah, it doesn't really taste like cotton candy to me. Maybe only, like, 10%, like, cotton candy-wise. But, um, to me it's probably more like, um, maybe about, like, um, 40%. Well... Yeah, maybe like 40%, like um, like that berry flavor. Maybe about like 50%, um, the bubblegum flavor. So yeah, the bubblegum flavor definitely stands out, definitely in the aftertaste, but um, yeah, to me it's definitely more like a berry flavor, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, still really good though, it's a really cool can design, I like the colors of it and stuff. I guess okay price, maybe around $3 a can at GNC. And I'm probably around the same price at like the Kroger owned grocery stores, maybe a little bit cheaper there though than GNC. And I don't know if you'll be able to find this in Otter, because um, this has been out for a while, and now they're already starting to get rid of them. This was like Energy Drink Josh's last can, was the one that he sent me to review, you know, that he traded with me for. Um, so I don't know if you can get any more of this. The yeah, Energy Wise, so definitely you lit as on 200 milligrams caffeine, has the B vitamins and stuff. And yeah, um, I'd probably say energy wise, last about five hours, about six and a half hours of energy, and we work a little bit more. So, oh yeah, boys, will definitely get you lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Energy wise, it works really good. It has a really cool, colorful can design, like the colors of it and stuff. Blue is like one of my favorite colors, so yeah, it's definitely a really cool looking can. Um, yeah, it was hard for me to get, but um, I don't know if it was like hard for you to get, so I guess just look around, I guess, at GNC or your Kroger owned grocery stores. Um, there's a list on the Kroger website of all the different grocery stores they own. They're in like a lot of different states, but um, there's none in my state though. Um, so yeah, thanks Energy Drink Josh for trading with me. It's a really cool can. Um, has a unique flavor, but um, definitely doesn't taste like cotton candy to me. Maybe only a teeny bit. Definitely more like a berry flavor. Um, but yeah, still I'd like definitely like berry bubble gum. So yeah, still like this though. But um, yeah, I think the um strawberry splash one is still a little bit better. But um. This one has a little bit of a chemically smell and taste, but I'm um, still pretty good though. 
Yeah, and also has a little bit of that like powdery, like sort of like bubble gum sort of taste. Like um the real bubble gum, you know, when you get like that um bubble gum and that was in like that um bubble tape sort of thing where it had like that powder on it. Remind me of that a little bit too, so yeah. I'll probably give the cotton candy bubblicious ghost energy drink. Even though I was a little bit disappointed in it, I still actually do like it. I already drink like almost like half the can or like a little bit over half the can. Um uh, compared to like the strawberry splash one, this one would be more like a 9 out of 10. Um, that one would definitely be a 10 out of 10, but um, this though, for the overall score though, I still think definitely deserves a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's still lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm gonna give the Cotton Candy Bubblicious Ghost a 10 out of 10. It's lit. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah, it's smooth. You know, it's not too carbonated. You can probably chug it if you want to. Energy wise, it works really good. It has a cool can design. It's okay price. So, yeah, definitely try it if you can still find it, I guess. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Anyway, um, I already have like the next 20 something reviews filmed, but anyway, my next review that I'm going to be uploading is the Cali Splash Redcon 1 review. Stay tuned for that review. So I'm not going to review several videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And I was going to try to do something. Well, I've um, paid off my car recently, so I'm going to try to get maybe some rare energy drinks that I'll be reviewing maybe in a few weeks, maybe to a couple months. Uh, so I'll do some more special reviews. Um, but yeah, anyway, stay tuned, peace out, and bye.